make him feel very welcome, ladies and gentlemen, Sebastian Borg! <laughs> Hey, hello. 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 My name's Sebastian Borg. No, I'm not from Star Trek. <laughs> Resistance is futile. <laughs> I don't actually uh, enjoy it when people liken me to sci-fi characters. I have a phobia of hobbits. Vengeful, vengeful, vengeful drunks. Perfect nut goblin height. Whoa, Frodo, save that for Sam. <laughs> Anyway, enough about my Middle Earth experiences. I often do get <laughs> I often do get likened to sci-fi characters, though, not due to my um, looks. Well, actually, yes, sometimes due to my looks. But um, I have an unusually fast metabolism. Now, I get many compliments from middle-aged women saying, "Oh, you're so lucky to have a fast metabolism. I wish my metabolism was as fast as yours." No, there is nothing enjoyable about having to go poo five minutes after every meal. <laughs> Seriously. I get to work in the morning, drive my car really fast into the car park, run to the door, put the key in the door. People are like, why are you so keen to get to work? I'm not keen to go to work, I'm just keen to go to the toilet because part two of breakfast has already begun. <laughs> or even worse, out to date with a girl. Hot girl preferably, doesn't happen too often, but we'll go with it. Um, Three course meal, hopefully not Mexican. <laughs> After every meal, you've got to get up and run a steeple chase to the bathroom. Not an attractive look or self esteem building. <laughs> Seriously, it's like being in the Olympics for poo. <laughs> And coming up after the poo vault and the log jump <laughs> is Sebastian Borg in the fecal chase. <laughs> well, how about at home? I live with uh, a variety of different housemates. Uh, well, I always usually seem, apparently to them, to take a long time in the bathroom at home as well. They're always like, oh, you always take so long in the bathroom, man. Why are you in there? Like, what are you doing? Rubbing one out? <laughs> no. Is that somewhere where someone wants to spend extended amounts of time? Seriously, it's a one bathroom house. There's about four or five people that live there. Every time you're in there, sitting down, you've got to try and dodge the pubic hairs on the tiles with your feet. Seriously, by the end of it, my big toe looks like Cousin It off the Adams Family. <laughs> Well, what makes it worse is that when every single person in your house has different coloured hair, you know exactly whose hair is on your team. <laughs> or possibly, they've all had a trim recently. So you're looking down at the ground, it's like looking at M&Ms in hair form. <laughs> Seriously, it looks like everyone got every single character off Sesame Street and just shredded them up in the bathroom. <laughs> Elmo likes maintenance. <laughs> Seriously, in, in which decade did it become okay for people to just trim their pubes all over the floor? I mean, what are, their parent, what are these parents teaching their children? I mean, what is wrong with the world these days? I mean, another thing that's wrong with the world, there is too many goddamn people. Seriously, in, 20, in less than 20 years, Asia's going to be responsible for over half the population of the world. First of all, I've always thought Asians were terrible at picking up girls, but what, what are they putting in their water? Seriously, I mean... Do they need to raise the price of drinks in Asia so girls aren't so damn easy? Or... <laughs> That's why we all go there, isn't it? <laughs> Seriously, the, the beaches are lovely, but we all know why we go to Phuket. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I've never been to Thailand, guys. <laughs> anyway, um, another interesting thing. Environmentalists must be getting into the condom industry. This is what happens when people use recycled materials. Al Gore has just always got to stick his nose and everything, doesn't he? Climate change, whaling, condoms. <laughs> Maybe that's why I didn't win the presidency. <laughs> Unlucky. Ooh. Anyway, guys, I just ate before this show and uh, I had another two minutes of material, but that's me out of here. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Yeah. I think uh, I think I think I think we've got a, we've got another contestant. He said, did he say Phuket? Phuket. 
it's with a it's with a ph it is fuck it right there's no getting around that it's fuck it like you don't call people pahilip do you 